Hi everyone, welcome back to Medi Angels Career Solution. Don't forget to subscribe our channel for more videos and do press the bell icon for new updates. Let's see how the situation works out. Let's start. Good morning. Good morning. Am I talking to Ms. Richa Kerry? Indeed. Hi, I'm Anuja, one of the registered nurses working in your community health center. Mm -hmm. How may I address you? Oh yeah, you can call me Richa. Okay, Richa. So is that the right time to talk to you? Exactly, yeah. Okay, so if I'm not wrong, you are taking some medications for your diabetes, is that right? Yeah, I'm taking oral medications, yeah. Okay, so today I came here to inform you regarding some of the recent changes in your medication. So can I proceed with that? Oh, what changes? Okay, I will explain you in detail regarding that. Based on your current investigation results, your doctor has decided to change your insulin oral medications to insulin injection. Oh, why injections? Why all of a sudden? Because I have been maintaining my blood glucose levels in a normal way using my oral medications. Mm -hmm. Why should I sh suddenly change to uh, insulin injection? Okay, it's a reasonable question. But you know, currently your blood glucose level is very high and oral medication is not effective in controlling your current med glucose level. So you need to change your medication to insulin injection to get a better progress in your condition. Are you clear with that? I am, but you know, I have never used an injection like by myself. Mm -hmm. So I don't know how to use it or where to use it. So you will have to enlighten me with all this information. Definitely, I will give you proper explanation regarding how to take the injection and where you can take this injection so sure. can I proceed with that yeah please okay so you know insulin injection you can take it either over your abdomen mm -hmm. or over the inner part of your thighs okay okay so while taking the injection make sure that you clean the area using a sterile alcohol swab and after cleaning the area you can inject the medication directly into the area where you, where you choose for giving the injection okay. okay and one more thing I need to tell you is that before taking the injection make sure that you loaded the correct dose of medication okay but how will I ensure that I have loaded the accurate dosage your question is reasonable but you know in the syringe there is marking like one two three and all so currently your doctor has prescribed eight units of insulin for you so during uh, before taking the injection make sure that uh, you loaded up medication appropriately you mean to the eight point yeah yes to the eight point so if you feel any discomfort while doing uh, loading the medication or mm -hmm. if you face any difficulties in loading the medication nowadays insulin pens are also available so if you want I can arrange an insulin pen for you how does that sound okay so I don't have to load by myself yes oh that sounds like a good plan so that will be more convenient for me okay definitely I will arrange an insulin pen for you and one more thing I need to tell you is that after taking the injection please make sure that you don't rub the area oh why can't I rub my area because normally when we take an injection we do rub the area where we have been injected so why not in this case it's a good question but you know insulin needs a slow absorption so if you rub the area after taking the injection it will get absorbed quickly so it will cause some sudden decrease in your blood glucose level and some complications okay okay i get so it so to prevent that complications please make sure that you don't rub the area after taking injection sure. are you clear with that yes i am okay so one more thing i need to tell you is that after taking the injection please make sure that you discard these needles in a in a safe manner to prevent needle stick, needle prick injuries. Okay, will you be providing me with any sort of containers for that? Okay, so for that we will give you a container so you can discard these needles into that container after each injection and once the container is filled we will come and take it back to our center. I'm yeah, sure I'll safely discard it. Yeah. Okay, I'm very happy to hear that and now I will show you how to take the injection and I will take the first dose of your insulin injection. So after that you can take it by yourself sure. and in between if you experience any difficulties while taking the injection you can just contact with us. We will come and take the injection. Definitely. Thank you very much. Thank you. 